this is a Van de Graaff generator. Its whole purpose is to make this big metal sphere be very, very charged, while uh, the base of it, which this python is connected to, stays relatively neutral. And so what happens when I hold the python next to the sphere is that you get these glorious sparks. I got together a couple of my students. This is Sue and Katrina. They were kind enough to agree to be on the show to show this Van de Graaff generator. If you stand on the floor and touch the metal sphere, you're gonna get some pretty nasty shocks. But if you stand on something a little taller, that's an insulator, it'll just start to charge you over time. This can lead to some pretty interesting results. Like saying here, it's really not too complicated a principle. All that's happening <laughs> is that our bodies and our hair and everything else is getting charged. I'm actually not sure off the top whether it's getting a negative charge or a positive charge, but it honestly doesn't matter. Let's say we're getting positively charged. That means that every hair on my head is getting positively charged. So they're all repelling each other. If you're ever trying to make this happen, it's always best if you have someone who doesn't have too much product in their hair, who has pretty thin hair, and a sort of medium length is always good. It happens to work really well with my hair. It's such a simple principle, and yet it can do some really cool stuff. For instance, if I put these pieces of tissue paper on there, they become a little bit charged as well. And then whenever I let that charge go a little bit, they dip a little, because they lose charge for just a moment there. Or once the generator's turned off, they lose charge completely. In theory, only conductors should be able to pick up charge, but when there's this much charge around, sometimes insulators can do so as well. This is a jar full of, what is it, yogurt? Oh, oh that's not yogurt. Anyway, this is one of my favorite demos to do in class, even though I tend to get shocked a lot when I do it because it's a little bit dangerous. Like this video if you liked it, and subscribe if you want to see more cool stuff like this. And I should be discharged now enough to put stuff down. Okay, cool. <laughs>